My name is Emma McDonald and I'm with Library Services. I'm also a certified Google for Education trainer. Have you ever worried about being able to access your Google Drive files and folders when the internet is down? This episode will show you two different settings you can enable to access your files and folders in Drive while offline. To start, go to drive.google.com or click on the waffle and choose Drive. Next, click on the gear and choose settings. Look halfway down this box for the word offline. If you check this box so that it is blue, it will allow you to create, open, and edit your recent Google Docs Sheet Slides files while offline. Once you do that, you will see this circle and a checkbox. This will allow you to turn on your offline preview. When you click that button, this shows you how your files and folders will look when you are offline. The second way to get offline access is to download Drive for Desktop. This will not work on Chromebooks. It only works for desktop and laptop computers. First, click on the gear. Next, click Get Drive for Desktop. If you use the old Drive file stream, you need to uninstall that first. Otherwise, click here for Download and Install Google Drive for Desktop. Then choose whether you're using the Windows platform or the Mac platform. When you click on this button, a file will automatically be downloaded onto your desktop or laptop computer. Double click on that file to open and run it. Follow the instructions. Once it has been installed, click on the Explorer folder or the Finder window folder. Open that up. Once you're in there, you should see the Google Drive icon. When you click on it, you will see My Drive and any shared drives that you belong to. Double click on My Drive to see all of the folders and then again the files that are within those folders. You can then click and open and that file or folder will open up so that you can access it. The nice thing about this is you can also click and drag anything from your desktop into that Google Drive and it will show up in that folder. So this is an easy way to get files and folders from your desktop into your Google Drive. As soon as you are connected to the internet, it will automatically sync. So if you're already connected to the internet, anything that you click and drag will sync into your Google Drive. Definitely give it a minute or two. Uh, don't expect instantaneous uh, upload and syncing, but it is pretty fast. So within a couple of minutes, everything should be uploaded depending on how many files and folders. I mean, obviously, if you're uploading a thousand files into your Google Drive, that will take a little bit of time. Now, let's say, for example, that you uh, have downloaded Google Drive, installed it, and but you don't see Google Drive showing up in your folders here. So what you can do is in uh, on a PC, click on that little Windows icon. In Finder, go to Applications and then scroll and search for Google Drive. Click on Google Drive to enable it. You'll see a little message. Google Drive is already running on this desktop. Click OK. But what that does is it starts it up again in case it has been accidentally closed down. So that is how you can access it if you don't see it on your screen. Now, if you don't have internet access, you'll still be able to access and work with any and every drive uh, file and folder that is in showing up on your desktop in your Google Drive. Once the internet is reconnected, then all any and all of the changes that you have made will show up and sync to your online drive. You may be prompted to enter in an admin username and password in order to download and install the program. If that is the case, you will need to put in a request with the help desk and someone will get in touch with you and will help you download and install that program. Uh, if you do have other questions about Google Drive file stream from the download page, you can scroll down and you will find other help articles and information from Google. See you next time.